as the person who kind of proposed the idea of what the general consensus of what impact was going to represent, it stands to reason that the mission statement of impact is the same as what I want to get across, which happens to be, I want people to play games, make games, and perpetuate the idea of games in any industry, in any platform, in any type of criteria they can. So, whether this be writing, developing, programming, discussing, talking, playing, uh, broadcasting, spectating, that type of stuff, whatever perpetuates the gaming scene and pushes it forward and brings a community together, that's what I wish to implement. That's what I wish to bring together. That's the focus of what impact is. But that's relying on the individual of one person, their response, like their actions, making a ripple within the scene, and just seeing how far that can take them. Because ultimately, how do you make a game? It's not just one person, it's a group of people. If you make one game on your own, you're pretty damn impressive. You're end of the league. You're very skilled in what you do, but you're also making a very particular type of game, which is awesome. But it also involves a community of people to entirely make games. That's why we have massive companies. That's why we wish to kind of represent that. But in terms of what I'm trying to get across is that it's the ideas and the aspirations of the one individual who's interested in games and wishes to pursue it further. If they don't, that's fine. It's just let's see how they let's see how you do. Just try it out and take it from there. And impact our site is a good way of going about that. With our industry experts and those who are doing the course as I am. These are the stepping stones. And we shall see you along the way.